Hey everyone, Mandy Lee here. I am out here at the Hershey RV Show to take a look at the exciting new changes that New Camp RV is making to their 2024 lineup of teardrop trailers. And there are some exciting changes, so let's not waste time on an intro. First, let's start by taking a look at the teardrop that started it all for me, the tag. Now, starting with these 2024 models, there's going to be some changes to the standard configurations that are offered. The Boondock Edition is now going to be the standard offering. However, you will still have the option to opt for the more classic looking tag, or you can upgrade to the new Boondock Black Canyon package, which stick around to the end of this video and I'll tell you just what's included in that. Now, let's take a walk around the outside of the Black Canyon Edition tag. First, you'll notice we still have the beautiful upgraded fender from last year. It's all one piece and this is weight bearing, which is awesome. On the boondock package, you still also have the boondock handle, which is really cool. Moving around the front, we've got the platform here. And new to this 2024 model year, we have a split uh, tongue box in the front. So you can open one side and you can see your propane. And on the other side, we've got our batteries. While we're talking about batteries, every single unit, no matter which edition of the tag you get, is going to come with one 100 amp hour lithium battery. And they've upgraded the solar to 100 180 watt on the top of every unit. These Battleborn lithium batteries do have an internal heater, so you don't have to worry about them operating in the cold weather. They've also reintroduced the solar port in case you have portable solar panels you want to plug in. There you go. Furthermore, this new tongue box has a weather sealed compartment for the batteries so that you don't have to worry about the elements getting to your batteries. All right, as we move around to the other side of the tag, you can see we still have the side mounted spare that they started in 23. I think it's a great placement and it looks kind of cool. And then moving on around to the back is our kitchen. Now back here, you might right off see some changes for 2024. First of all, they have made this beautiful removable cutting board as part of the counter. So it just makes cooking in here a whole lot easier. Also, guess what we have? a new 12 volt refrigerator that is going to come in every edition of the tag. And this microwave is also now going to be an option. A lot of people have taken out the microwave for more storage, but now you can get it that way from the factory. Moving on, we still have our two burner stove right here, as well as a sink. And get this, I have great news. They have changed the fresh gallon tank from 11 up to 25 gallons. And finally, in this great looking galley, we still have this extra large storage compartment under the sink. So lots you can do back here when you're cooking up that camp meal. Moving back around to the front, um, we still have all of our classic features over here. We have an external shower. Um, this is the water fill port. We've got a power port. And then of course our cable plug-in as well. I guess there's one thing left to do, go inside. On the inside, you will see not much has changed from previous years with the exception of a beautiful new color of stain. We have the same features we've always had. We still have a heater, we still have an air conditioning, and lots of storage. There's cabinets above the feet, um, in the middle, between those shelves. We've got cabinets above the head. We have the sliding storage that's behind the head of the bed. And of course, there's still under bed storage as well. One of my all-time favorite things about the tag is the windows, particularly the stargazer window, which is right over your head. As you're laying in bed, you can see the sky. All of the windows have two types of screens, one that allows airflow and, of course, a blackout screen as well. We still have the fan that allows for really great airflow. We've also got reading lights on each side of the bed. We've got cup holders. There are outlets on both sides of the head of the bed and an outlet at the foot of the bed. While the tag doesn't come with a TV, it does have access for easy installation if you want to add your own. Remember when I told you about this awesome new Black Canyon package? Let me tell you what that includes. First of all, you're going to get an additional 120 watts of solar in addition to the 180, making it a total of 300 watts of solar. For the first time, there is a hot water heater in the tag. They've added a heater to the fresh water tank, so you don't have to worry about it when you're out in the cold. 
They've added some awesome new red underglow lights, one so you can see outside, and also it's not gonna hurt your night vision. And finally, you might notice this fancy new mattress I am sitting on. It is a custom tri-fold mattress so that you can fold it up into a lounge seat. Now there's one more super exciting upgrade you can do. Regardless of which configuration you get, you can upgrade your lithium. So instead of getting one 100 amp hour battery, you will get two, so that a total of 200 amp hours, and they're gonna include a 2000 watt inverter with a smart shunt. Now this inverter will power every one of the outlets, the heater, and get this, the air conditioner. And finally, New Camp is offering a brand new type of warranty. It's called the Ultimate Protection Plan. This plan is seven years, it's transferable with no deductible, and it covers everything from tip to tail. It's pretty great. So ask your dealer about it when you go purchase a camper. Wow, there have been so many cool changes to the 2024 tag. It now has every feature that I always wished it had when I had my very first one a long time ago. And uh, it just allows for all the comfort now for those longer stints when you're out boondocking. So here's to hitting the road in your tag. Love and light. Okay, I'm not gonna, I have to do this. Give me some signal when you start it. They've also reintroduced the sour, sour port. It's good enough.